everyone, it's me, I'm back again. I've got a great surprise for you. Yes I do, we're gonna make burritos. Awesome, burritos, yummy. <laughs> now, I'm gonna show you the ingredients that I'm gonna be using. Are you ready? Are you ready, ready, ready? Okay, give me just a few minutes. I'll just get it all prepared, right? I'll be back. Okay, I'm ready. Burrito time. These are my ingredients. Now, over here we have avocado. Mm -mm. And there we have uh, tomatoes. And this is lettuce. This is actually um, iceberg lettuce. And we have red onions. Uh, in America, these called are green peppers, but they're actually capsicums called in New Zealand. And this is a uh, an empty bowl. There's nothing in that bowl. And over here we have the sauce. Uh, the sauce comes out of a packet, out of this box here. Burrito. Oh, it's not burritos. Okay. Hang on. That's burritos. What am I These are our chicken breasts. As you can see, they are boneless. One button. Turn temperature on. Put it on about. I'm going to put it on about five. Four elements. There we go. We'll let that sit for about a minute. And then we'll throw the chicken on. Chicken pieces. Time. Added a little bit of olive oil in there, and I'm going to add. Ooh, can you hear that sizzling? Okay, chicken pieces. Mm. Chicken pieces. Can you see the chicken pieces going white? See, a bit of white there, and pink bit there. Let's turn it over. Are you getting hungry? There's a sachet with all the seasonings on it. Now you can make your own, um, but I'd rather just use this. Why not? I'm tired, I work hard all day. It's easy. I love chemicals. <laughs> chemicals. <laughs> It says something about, uh, yeah, they added the capsicums. Aha, squeeze over lime juice. No, I better go and do that. Limes. We have limes. The seedless too. No seeds. Okay, now we're putting the lime over the meal, as you can see. Here's to put these guys in the microwave for about 10 seconds. Now it's time to put the chicken pieces onto these round circular bread things. Should I have some a few more? Oh, why not, eh? Here's another little piece there for me. And uh, why not? Go and grab another piece. There we go. Chicken pieces. Now I'm going to put some lettuce on. Put some green peppers. And some pieces of avocado. Tomatoes. Some dipping sauce. Where'd that come from? This guy. Oh, okay, why not? Cheese. What's this? Cream. Cream cheese. Yeah, why not? I made a bit of a boo boo. I wasn't meant to use uh, cream cheese. I'm going to use sour cream instead. <sighs> oh, so hungry. <gasps> Are you hungry? I am really hungry. Hold them together, apparently you have to use toothpicks. 
So I've got to take power. To, to actually roll these things, you have to just all to one side and then, and then grab the other side and wrap it over. See? See how it's all going to one side? And them all over. See? See that? And then we'll get our seat pick. Dinner. Now that is a nice meal. Hi! Now, thank you for coming to Derek's Kitchens. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now, remember, make sure that everything is turned off. And, and also, if you haven't got time to do the dishes, just throw everything away. I do. <laughs> what do you think of that? Hey, eh? that is what you call a display. Mm -hmm. If you find your meal too hot, then you can actually water it down with some Pepsi. I do not do any advertising whatsoever. Mmm, <laughs> Pepsi. Mm. Hot, hot, hot. Ah. Hey, would you like some? Mm. Thank you for visiting Darren's Kitchen. See you next time. When you prepare food, especially chicken, you got to make sure that you clean everything. All your utensils, everything. These guys and this, you must have clean. You do not want to be spreading salmonella all over the place. Especially on your fingers, your hands, your clothes. Right? So, little safety. Safety, uh, yeah. Okay, back to the cooking.